Okay, hello, we're looking at a Mustang Mach-E, and I will try and see if I can't um, explain how the all this cooling systems uh, stuff works. So what we have here is we have two separate cooling loops. So we have one here for the motor and electronics, another one here for the high voltage battery and the cabin heater. So starting um, at the motor electronics, there's a radiator here, and the fluid, this, the only coolant that goes through that radiator is the motor electronics coolant. So it actually comes out of the radiator down down over there. It's kind of dark, I can't see it, but it picks it up right here. And then it flows across underneath the tub and it goes into this motor here. And then this motor pumps it up, pumps it up this tube, and it goes into this electronic device there. Because comes up this tube into the electronics. And that's the level one, level two uh, charger, high voltage battery charger. And then there's a, couple, there's a pipe back here, a couple pipes back here, so you might be able to see it, a little blue tape. That's the out coming out of that uh, charger. You can actually um, see um, that, it's cut, well, that it's coming out of the charger there. So, and then it runs across the top into the DC to DC converter. Then it comes out of the DC to DC converter here and runs back and it, sh and it juts down back behind that compartment and runs all the way to the back motor and then it circulates through the rear motor. Then it comes back out through the rear motor. It comes out through, there's three. There's two more pipes here you can see. This, this back one there, the one I'm touching there, the farthest one, where we now picked it up with yellow tape, goes into this, um, the inverter. It's the front motor inverter um, electronic system. It goes into it and then this pipe here is coming out of it and it comes out of that and it goes it drops back down to the back of the front motor which is this thing here the front drive motor so this cool this tube here this yellow one here I'm touching goes down the back and into this motor here circulates through that motor and then it comes out of the motor right there there's an auxiliary pump behind this bracket and then it comes through that tube and it goes right back into the radiator and circulates that way so that's how the motor uh, electronics cooling loop works. And that's how it circulates. So there's two pumps. There's a main pusher pump here, and then an auxiliary pump that um, is more like a suction pump like, to bring it back.